Good evening. Thanks for joining us tonight. We cover the uh, Culver versus uh, Rochester here tonight. I'm Jeremy Swangle here with Libby Woodjick. Woodjick. <laughs> yep. Okay. I knew I wouldn't remember that. <laughs> no one ever does, but it's Woodjick. all right. <laughs> so it's a nice night for softball here. Sun's shining. I actually got a nickname this week. Oh, you did? Yeah, by Ted Denton, the mayor. Okay. What did he What did he nickname you? Wojo from Wojo. that old show. Okay. <laughs> Wojo. Well, it works, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> That's actually my dad's nickname, so it's just, it all goes together. He told mm -hmm. me I'm the next generation. Put it down. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's a funny guy, isn't he? Oh, yeah. Rochester taking some... Uh, Pitches here, getting ready. Culver ready to take the field here. Alright, so it doesn't appear that we have a scoreboard at this time, um, so we'll do our best to keep track. We have the uh, very edge of third base. We apologize for that, just because of the way the camera sets in the uh, fence. We are working on a solution for that. All right, looks like Culver is uh, in the batter's box, ready to take the first pitch here. Ball outside. Pitch two is a ball. Ball low and outside. A nice hit there. Got past third base. Past the outfielder a little bit. For a double. Ball. <laughs> Ball outside. Ball inside, and the second base runner steals third on a wild pitch.
Ball way outside. Runner on third, steals home for a run. We have a score of 1-0. Batter gets to uh, take first base. <laughs> Libby, are you enjoying the game? I am enjoying the game. I'm actually <laughs> taking the score down on my phone for oh, you. Oh, perfect. Just so you, we can all remember. Yeah, good. You, you don't know me that well, but that's... One thing you've got figured out already. I don't have a good memory, do I? Hey, we're one in the same right there. <laughs> well, I appreciate that. <laughs> that is a ball. And uh, I don't have names, but this is number zero. Number 10 was just up, and I did not see what number scored. Ooh. Nice hit. Nobody could get underneath it. It's a foul ball. Salt hit the shortstop. She's able to get it knocked down. I'm trying to eat a hot dog over here. It's not working too well. <laughs> Sometimes right. Mike's getting away. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, runners at first and second here. Ooh. Foul ball on the first pitch to her, number six. Uh, we have no outs. Score of 1-0, Culver. All right, runner at second, steals third. So that's a major difference in softball and baseball. You have to tag them to get them out. Well, it's the same actually. There's not a runner when they're stealing like that. They actually have to tag them. So if they can get in underneath the tag, they're safe. Ah, okay, okay. You'll learn something new every day. Yep. <laughs> Ooh. Ball inside. Actually, dead ball, so she was hit by it, so she gets to take a base. All right, now we have runners at uh, first and third, and we have a score of 2 0, and no outs. <clears throat> yeah. Ball. Runner at first, deal second. That's the first strike of the game. There it is. <laughs> Ball outside. We just don't have the third base in shot. Close, but just not quite there. <laughs> Foul ball. to second base, who gets it to first for the out. 
Number zero gets back around and scores. I believe we have a score of three to zero now. We have a runner on uh, third. Ball high and outside. Ball wants to come in a little high. Looked about perfect as far as center of the plate to me. Well, that sun's just perfectly in our eyes, isn't it? <laughs> hey, I, I decided I was going to sit back a little and just just sit in the shade. <laughs> yeah, the uh, runner steals home on a wild pitch, giving us a score of four runs to zero. Ball four, runner. Number nine takes her base. Batter number eight up to the plate. Ball on that pitch. Do you have prescription sunglasses? I do have prescription sunglasses. They change. These are my normal glasses, and uh -huh. then they just change in the sun. It's like transition that. lenses, man. I've wanted these forever, and my mom finally got them for me as a present. <laughs> Very nice. All right, that batter was hit by a pitch. She gets to take her base. We have a... Uh, can't see the number. Maybe... 12 or something? I can't see, but she is a lefty. Swing and a miss Ooh. is a strike. Both runners steal. 11, number 11. Number 11, okay, thank you. Of course. This is summertime, I feel it. Uh -huh. I, yeah. I feel summer. Yeah, it's summer all right, isn't it? Granted, I was living in South Carolina during February when everybody was getting snow. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and I had a uh, 72 degree weather yeah. out on my hammock. Ball high and outside. Yeah, so <laughs> Oof. we're done talking with Libby now. <laughs> <laughs> Getting everybody jealous. Hey, I don't live there no more, so. Yeah. Yeah. All right, picked up two more runs on steals there. I don't know what that puts our score at, five? Uh, that is going to put us at six if six. it was two more. Six and zero. Oh. Well, you're gonna miss those winners, aren't you? Living back here. Oh man, the winner's Swing gonna be a tough one. Yeah. But I'm ready. I mean, I grew up here, so I'll be okay. <laughs> yeah, you can't beat a good old Indiana summer. Oh yeah, baseball, softball. Yeah. And lakes. Behind outside. Love the lakes and the rivers. Mm -hmm. Ooh, a nice swing, but it is foul. Uh -huh. She'll come back, so she's at two strikes. And I don't know how many balls she was at, but. No, I believe we're still at one out. Ball outside. It's ball four.
ball very high. Runner on first, steals second, and looking to steal third. But she's gonna hold. Ball came in behind the batter, who's number 14, and the runner on second steals third. We're struggling here as we open this game up here with our pitching. Ball's loose. And another runner comes in to score. Seven to zero. There must be a seven run rule, which means that the girls will now uh, come in and bat. So they're gonna wanna get their bats rolling here. <clears throat> I like that rule, seven's my favorite number. Is it? Yeah. I was born in July on the 21st, oh. and I, I like the number three, too. So seven, three, yeah. 21. I like it. It's all, it's all working out. Nice. July 21st, huh? Yeah, my golden birthday. Mm. July 21st. That's coming up this year, and it's a Saturday. <laughs> you know when I had my golden birthday? When? When I was eight. Did you know it was your golden no, birthday? No, I didn't. Nobody was... Told me that. Nobody so. taught you at a young no, age. No, no. I've no. been looking forward to this for a while now. <laughs> yeah. My two oldest were born on June 21st, so they'll have that, and then. Uh, you have twins. I have two sets of twins. You have two sets of twins. Yep. Oh. Yep. And then my. Your wife, bless her. Yeah. She's, <laughs> yeah. You know, it wasn't all her. No. <laughs> Oh, I'm talking about the either. birth part. Yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, God love her, I tell you what. Any woman, for that matter, that's a traumatic experience, for, let me tell you. But it's also a blessing. Yes, it is. So you have twins, they go to Rochester? Yes, yep, they do. Do I know one? I don't know. What grades are they um, in? No one lives in ninth. And okay. Then Aaron and Eli are in seventh. Okay. I probably wouldn't know them, but I definitely I know some kids that I've helped with filming and mm -hmm. things like that. Okay. Worked with. Yeah. And then Aaron and Eli, they were born on April sixteenth. So. Yeah, I've explained to them their whole golden birthday thing. So. That's awesome. Yeah. They're They're gonna be ready for it. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> 16 and 21 are very influential birthdays. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Now you just have to have a set that were born on the 18th of something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, let's hold off there, okay? <laughs> no I've more had, twins. I've had enough sets. <laughs> Happy with what we got. All right, Rochester's up to bat here. Ooh. Looks to bunt, but... All right. And who do we have? Is it number seven? Number one. Oh, number one. Ooh, man. The foul ball right away. Rochester would like to return the favor here. Oh, she bunts the ball. Oh. Right to the second baseman. Or first baseman. And who gets it back to uh, the second baseman for the out. Oh. All right. First there pitch. She swings at it, hits it, but it fouls.
And a swing and it right to the shortstop. And she's safe. Wow. ball outside. We do have a runner on first. Number five at bat. There we go. It's a nice hit. Gets the second base runner out. Alrighty, we're going to, uh, since we don't have a scoreboard cam, I'm going to just kind of keep a uh, score going here at the top here for you. We're in the uh, top of the second inning. I feel like all I need is an apple pie, and then this is exactly what America's supposed to be about. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't get much more American than apple pie, you know? Oh, yeah. Apple pie, softball. Summertime. Yeah, I like the summertime. I, I, the older I get, the less I like winter. I think I was born like not liking winter. Yeah. We're a summertime <laughs> baby, so. See about modifying this here. <laughs> 
Alright, so we'll be in the top of the second inning here with Culver back at bat. First pitch is a ball. That one just went straight up. Scored another run here. I do apologize with the scoreboard. We're trying some different things here, so um, we, we didn't have a scoreboard tonight, so we just uh, tossing some numbers up in here, so bear with us. Steals third. Ball inside. Runner steals home. We now have a score of nine runs to zero. I do well, have to say. Well, no, they took that run back. I don't uh -oh. know what happened there. There it is. Oh, the batter got hit by uh, a ball, so it was a dead ball, so the runner on third wasn't able to steal home. Strike on the pitch with a swing and a miss, number 12. And she gets a hit right through the legs of the second baseman. Runners on first and second, and the third base runner gets hit home for a score of 9-0. Is that what you have? Good. I got 9-0 right over here. Perfect. 
I gotta say, these girls are on their toes. Mm -hmm. I would. I don't have the reflexes for this game. Yeah. I guess that's why I never played it. <laughs> <laughs> Ball high. Ball. Both runners are going to steal their respective bases. And we now have runners on second and third. Back home, get it back home. Oh. oh, she couldn't hold on to the ball. All right, we have a score 10 0. One out. Hits it for foul ball. <laughs> Matter home with runner on third. Ball high. Ball low. Here comes the runner on third. Is safe. Score of 11 to 0. All right. Ball outside. Turned out to be a pretty rough game here for Rochester. Ball outside. Hey, you got to remember it's about the fun. This is true. I know this is one of the um, older playing leagues mm -hmm. in the summer leagues, but uh, you know, in their hearts, they, they know it's for the fun. Ooh, Ooh, that was close. Oh, man. That's way out there. Yeah, Going to hit somebody's car. <laughs> <laughs> Where you parked at? I'm, I'm parked on the other side. Uh, good. <laughs> I know better. <laughs> Plate safe. Ball outside and high. Uh oh. Oh, oh no. couldn't hold on the ball, so. Oh, 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 oh. Boom. All right, that gives there us a score 12 0. Goodness. I can only imagine the adrenaline rush that oh, they get yeah. when they're running. Did you ever play sports? Uh, no, I didn't. I played a few growing up. Just soccer and basketball, you know, I'm a Hoosier. I play basketball oh, yeah. growing up. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing wrong with basketball. Yep. That's how we pick, that's how we get to the winners in Indiana. Oh yeah. That's the main thing to look forward to. Yeah. Those lady Z's. That got me through it. My my high school years filming for them. Oh yeah. Amazing. <laughs> Half the time I'd be behind the camera shaking like Oh, I'm so mad, or <laughs> shaking in excitement, and I'm like, gotta hold the camera still. <laughs> right. It's it could be 
I mean, it's Ooh. very exciting, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. Ball four, batter takes a base. Steal second. Let's go. Must be their pitcher or their catcher, so it's a courtesy runner. Ball outside. Piece of that one looks like it's gonna go foul. That sun's just kind of getting behind the pole back there a little bit, a little bit out of my eyes. <laughs> finally, giving me karma from what I said earlier. Now it's in my eyes. I lean forward. Ball rolled fair. Runners on first and third. Ball outside. Oh, oh. But she kept control of it. Runner on first, steal second. Runners now on first and third. Foul ball. Hit. Gets past second base. Out to center field. All right, and they have scored another seven runs. We have a score of 14-0, which ends the that part of the inning. Rochester's going to uh, look to get the bats rolling here. Again, we want to thank you for watching tonight. Rochester versus Culver. In our junior leagues here. We're at the uh, Black Eater Softball Field Complex. Here in Rochester, Indiana. I'm Jeremy Swango, and I'm here with Libby. And I don't even want to try the last name. I do apologize. <laughs> Libby Woodjick. Woodjick. There it maybe, is. Maybe you can call me Wojo. Or Wojo, that's yeah. great. I'm going to get that on my badge. Whoa, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> I could do that. I'm going to try to remember whoa, Joe. That might be a little bit easier for yeah. everybody. I just want to honestly give a thanks to all the adults that put in their free time to help these girls have a league. Yeah, it's a lot of volunteers out here. Definitely. It's when you see some parents getting worked up and mad at the umpires and coaches, you just want to kind of shake your head a little bit and say, you know, they're volunteering their time so that your child has an opportunity to play. Yeah, you do it. Exactly. You go do it. Exactly. No, uh -uh, I can't do it. So, no, it's, it's good to <laughs> Sit down. call out, make that out, and 
recognize those that do make it possible. All right, Rochester back up at the plate here. Here we go. Ooh. Strike that, one. That could have been a really good one, I feel like. Yeah. I felt that one in my heart. <laughs> yeah, I wanted it too. Ball inside. Ooh. Ooh. She's trying to hit him. Nah. That's I'm strike two. I, I missed. <laughs> huh. That's cool. Ooh. Ooh. Nice oh. pop up. Oh. Foul ball. There's some days I'm glad there's a fence in front of us. Amen to that. <laughs> When they come back like that, I'm always glad. <laughs> I was standing near the fence the other day with uh, Dakota. I think we were over at uh, uh, Fulton. And the foul ball got hit r I mean, right at me. But there was a fence. I still jumped. <laughs> There's no way that ball's going to get through that fence, but it startled me. Ooh, there nice we hit. Go. Nice hit out into uh, left field there. Awesome. Girl gets stopped. Uh-oh. She needs to get back to first, so she gets a single out of that. There we go. Number 10 is on first base. All right. A nice hit. Number 9 up to bat. Oh, swing and a miss. Tried to get back to to first to get the runner out, but the runner beat her back. There we go. All right, runner does steal second. Swing and a miss. I believe that is strike two. Oh, strike Ooh. three. Second steals third. Ball one. That's one thing I always like about Rochester. Their uh, mascot is the zebra, and there's not a lot of schools with that. I think there's actually only 11 in the nation with a zebra mascot. I'll be darn. And you can just find some of the coolest sports gear with zebra print. Mm hmm. And not many schools get to, you know, rep that gear. Right. Well, that's cool. Yep. I'm sure you're looking at her helmet. That's, oh, yeah. That's, that's what. Cool that's really yeah. what threw me off. I was like, oh, that's so cool. Yeah. Everybody else just has black ones, white ones, gold ones. My daughter loves all that zebra stuff. <laughs> I think as a uh, preteen to early teenage girl, it, it's a must have phase to to like cheetah print zebra print something mm -hmm. some type of print polka dots yeah neon well <laughs> we've gone through all those different prints and we've gone through the peace signs and there it is so. yeah <laughs> yeah the joys of having a girl <laughs> and that's your only girl right yes yep, yep. Ball outside, runners at first and third. Should have been ready, Ellie. No hesitates. Trying to get that runner out at first. All right. It's a swing and a miss for a strike. Oh, 
Oh. And strike three. I mean, there's two outs. Runners at first and th or third and second. And number three up to bat. Ball outside. Ooh, swing and oh, a miss. Oh, man, just brisked it. Almost. Yeah. You could tell. Uh-oh. Bases loaded with two outs. And I'm not sure where our next batter's at. <laughs> if we got a batter that saying she's sick, and then I'll have to be an out. I guess they're gonna let somebody, I don't know what's gonna happen here. So it looks like one of the players is, is feeling a little ill, so they're allowing another player to come in her place. That was way outside. She called it a strike, though. Whew. Strike on the swing. Ooh, everybody advanced except the... Nice. All right, Rach, this was on the board. Got one. What are you doing? Oh, no. Uh, they didn't run, so that's an out. Ah. Uh, so I, so I, still 14 and 0. Yeah. Mm. All right, well, this puts us in the top of the third inning. Not sure how things are going to go. Thank you. 
All right. Strike on the first pitch. To number nine. Ball on the second pitch. The bunt. There we go. Uh-oh. Ooh, got uh, her out. Got her. Good hustle. All right, number eight. Comes up to the batter's box. Hits it. Should be a nice toss right there to first. Got her out. Two up, two down. That's what Rochester's wanting to do. Brings up number 11 for Culver. Yeah, they're getting a little bit of... Getting feisty. Yeah, they are. Ooh, that was cool. Yeah, that was cool. Good hustle. I think I, I feel like that's a really uh, notorious thing Rochester's known for, just picking it up right when they need to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hopefully it's not too little too late. Mm, wild pitch. Another one of those pitches where you're glad the fence isn't running. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, batter's walked. Number 14. Oh. Foul ball on a bunt. This pitcher catcher doing a pretty good job hustling back here. Another bunt. Oh. She almost had that. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 no. Smack that girl. Mm -hmm. That ball totally hit her, and she just stood there like a, like a rock. Mm -hmm. I cannot imagine how much that hurts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it can't feel good. Oh. You're talking the umpire, right? Yep. Yeah, I was I was kind of surprised because she first came out with no leg protection on, and I was a little bit surprised by that. <laughs> well, she's putting a lot of faith in her catcher. Get behind it. Oh, it's fair, it's fair. There we go. All right, looks like they got a runner in. I got 15 and zero. Yep. That's gonna be game. 15. Run rule here. Ends the game. I do believe that is what happened. We should see them line up here, and if they do, we will go ahead and shut down. I don't know. The catcher's coming out, so.
Okay. I don't know. Are we sure that wasn't their third strike? Maybe it was. Out. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm still getting the lingo down. That's okay. <laughs> it must have been. I don't. I remember two. Right. So. Okay. Maybe that was three. <laughs> I'm gonna say it had to have been. Hey, I'm having fun, so. Yeah. I'm I'm having fun sitting here talking and watching the game, so I, I don't mind staying out for a yeah, little while me longer. Yeah, either. I know. Yeah, nothing like a taking a nice relaxing ball game and. Yeah, you know, there's a big crowd for a Thursday night. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's a do. that's a work night. Yeah. <laughs> and a school night. Yep. At least Still. for one more night. For a couple couple schools out there, yeah. they they have a whole another week. I feel like Caston's in that bunch. They Are got they? another week. Yeah, I know. Uh, my nephews and my niece they go to McConaughey, and I don't think they're done until next week. There it is. Yeah, Rochester. They're they're closing up on they're on done Friday. Tomorrow, yeah. They had a fun week. A whole bunch of them at the high school got to go see Hamilton. My son got to go. There we go. So. He came back pretty exhausted yesterday, but that's what a lot of them are saying. I guess maybe they had to walk a walk a bit. Yeah, to get there. But he went they, to uh, Chicago, right? Yeah, but he had fun. He said so. That's what matters. But yeah. I asked if he'd do it again. He said yes. Yeah, so. So that was the junior and senior class, or? Yeah, and then they took the like the top fifteen students from sophomore and freshman classes. Ah. See, that's why people need to keep their grades up. Yeah. <laughs> you get to do special stuff. All right. I don't know what she called that, but I'm going to say it was a ball. Ooh. Ball. A little low. Uh-oh. <laughs> a little too far. <laughs> well, it sounds like you got a pretty good grasp of the game. I'm going to go ahead and go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Yeah. <laughs> I could probably speak a little more next time. Oh, you're doing fine. I'm gonna go and look on Wikipedia. After this. You know what? You can just go um, Google some softball games and listen to like them. How, go. How to softball? <laughs> That'll be my Google search. But tomorrow night we're gonna be at the uh, middle school game. They'll be on the high school field out over there, at the uh, middle high school. And uh, Dakota's gonna be with you. Yeah, yeah, good old Dakota. <laughs> Him and I got to go shoot some B-roll footage yesterday, and it was fun. Oh, Found cool. some ducks. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, I like Dakota. He's a good kid. Now, he's got, to me, he's got two first names. D Dakota, what's his last name? Starts with an H, that's all I Hayden. know. Hayden. And... <laughs> I can. I always want to call him Hayden, and it's like I start. To, I get tripped up, and then it's like, poor guy. Probably he thinks, looks like a Hayden. I would. Yeah. I would say he yeah, looks I, like I a kind of go with that too. He's gonna hate us after this. Yeah, podcast. no kidding. <laughs> Ooh. I'm able to hear tomorrow what he thinks I look like. <laughs> <laughs> it may not be Jeremy. <laughs> oh my goodness. A oh, little bit of juggling there. Some of those cheers and stuff are so intricate. Uh huh. It's so specific to a certain. <laughs> 
<laughs> thing that happens on the field. Strike. You just got to wonder how many years have been put into oh, coming goodness. up with chants and cheers. Yeah. Well, I know that my daughter played softball for several years, and oh, the chants. Not only do they rhyme, and, but they, they say them faster and faster and faster. And I only know camp songs. I, I just went to camp as a kid and mm -hmm. did, did stuff like that, but can barely recall any of those. <laughs> <laughs> Much less every summer remember some chants about a fastball. <laughs> Oof. Oof, swing and a miss, or strike three. So close, man. Uh, okay. You can see the effort. That's uh -huh. what's that's what's there. That's that shows sportsmanship mm -hmm. to me. That's really winning. It's not about the numbers. Ball low. As somebody that doesn't see softball or baseball fields very often, I'm noticing, what are they called, mounds? Is that the bases? Uh -huh, the, yeah. The, those are way larger than I, ooh. They're way <laughs> larger than I ever imagined. Thought, yeah. yeah, I thought they were like, oh, your foot can fit on it. Yeah. These things are huge. Yeah. <laughs> Two girls on one. Yeah. <laughs> There we go. Got go, go, the go. All right. There. Oh, oh, all the way to third. Very nice. You have any big weekend plans? <sighs> it is Memorial Day weekend, mm -hmm. so I probably should. Uh, mowing the lawn. Oh, well, if you know anybody with a lawnmower, they could come over and mow my lawn. <laughs> where, do you, where do you live? Uh, oh, I, you probably don't want to say that out. No, you don't, yeah, I don't want to say that on, on the air, but I do live in a place I used to live in middle school. Okay. My mom was renting it as when I was a kid. Oh, so now you're there. That's cool. And now I rent it, and I have her old room, which is kind of weird. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, yeah. Well, I have three very capable boys with mowers, so that would be more than happy to help you out there. Hey, I'll give them a... I don't know. I think I could spare 10 bucks, All right, 15 well, bucks. Whatever you will feel fair. <laughs> it's not a very big yard. I just don't have a mower. Oh, she's going to come. She's got to get down, oh, get down. Oh, 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 oh. And she there makes it. it is. All right. Awesome. Number I've been, five. I've been on standby for, seems like forever. <laughs> All right. It feels good to be on the board. That's where it's at. Yep. I have to buy us an umbrella for the sun. <laughs> yeah. My hand's getting tired holding one up. Whoa. I've never seen nothing like that before. Yeah. Oh, nice Ooh. hit, nice hit. It gets knocked down, and she is safe at first. The runner held at second. Good call on her part. That has to be such a fulfilling moment to hit that and just mm -hmm. book it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> just the sound itself. The that, yeah, that ting. Yeah. Somebody got to make a decision here. Uh oh. Hey, y'all got to. Oh, ooh. Good. yeah. Good. Trade an error. Awesome. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> the world works in mysterious ways. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I don't even play softball, but I just want her helmet. It's just <laughs> calling me. It is a very sharp helmet. I can use it when I play with my dogs. Yeah. Like the rough house. <laughs> what kind of dogs you got? I got a wow. Nice that hit. That is awesome. There we go. One. Keep, oh, All ooh, right. There it is. Now we're three yeah. to 15. So fast, so quickly. I, that is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Their chance, they just yeah. get better and better as yeah. time goes on. Uh, I, I actually, I got a Sharpay boxer mix and a pit bull. Oh, so wow. I got some strange looking dogs, let me tell you. <laughs> they, they are my world though. Oh, good. Yep. No cats? No cats. My dogs would eat cats. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> no. Cats wouldn't have a chance here, would they? Yeah, I'm not really a cat person. I got asthma. Oh, just, they'll yeah. just mess that up. Do. I didn't see any signal, but I guess she's safe. That's good. Yeah. Strike. take long for things to change. There we go, four to 15. Let's try. <laughs> it looked kind of low on inside, but. I'm just learning the game. If she says it's a strike. Looks like they're cleaning off the uh, home plate, home base. We got one player on first. She is just getting ready and anticipating them. She just wants off that, that base. She wants to go to second. Looks like they're calling a timeout. So they can talk to their team. All right, 
there's the end of the timeout. We're going to start playing again. And we got one girl on second and one girl on first. Just waiting to get off those bases. Oh, oh, oh. There it goes. We got one on third and one on second now. Looks like there might have been something wrong with the ball. Could have split for all I know. <laughs> we are still at 15 and 4 right now. We got one girl on third and we got one girl on second. All right, another good awesome. hit here. There's a hit. Oh, and she couldn't quite get a hold of the ball. Oh. oh, got her out. But we got one. Yeah, we did. There's 15 to 5. That's a big thing about summer, staying hydrated. Yeah, I should be staying hydrated with just water. Diet Coke's not the best thing to be drinking, but... Hey, if your taf taste buds crave it, you got a short <laughs> life to live, may as well have it. That's what I tell my mom every time I came home with ice cream after yeah. work. She was like, you eat ice cream again? <laughs> hey, the Lord made me this way. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. What are you thinking? <laughs> Shouldn't have made it taste so good if you didn't want me to have it all the time. Well. <laughs> My daughter's an ice cream junkie herself. That's where it's at. You can put toppings on it. You can get different flavors. People that just settle for chocolate. Those yeah. people are, they're not living their life to the fullest. Yeah, no, I hear that. <laughs> My daughter would think that, you know, an ice cream would go well with a chocolate shake. You know, that's how much she likes it. She'd eat ice cream all three meals of the day if I let her. We're gonna try the flagpole tomorrow. The, the new, the new open, the newly opened flagpole. Yeah. So um, I don't know much about all that and who the new owners are and anything. Yeah, I don't either. I just know that we're. My wife and I talked today, and I think we're gonna go to the flagpole and give it a shot tomorrow. Just for ice cream. Yeah, yeah. I wonder if the menu has changed at all. You know, I don't know. Uh, you'll find out tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> I'll let you know the next time we work together. <laughs> Which I guess at this point might be next Friday. Yeah. There we go. Oh, no. oh, oh that was. No. Oh. That was an amazing effort there. Effort's where it's at. Yep. That shows. That shows everything. Yep. In my book, at least. Ooh, Oof. That was close. Oh, I did. I hit the ground before it hit her foot. I think they're going off the, after a projectile. Mm -hmm. The anticipation of where it may have hit. <laughs> We had instant replay. Maybe if we get a couple more cameras out here, talk yeah. Scott into it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the thing of it is, if 
Scott had all the resources available, that he would have a heck of a program of filming every every event. Yeah. He's got vision beyond most. He was telling us today he has to compress his vision sometimes. Yep. And then he just looked at me and said, you, <laughs> do that too. <laughs> I pitched him something today, um, RTZ version of The Office slash Parks and Rec. He said no. <laughs> now, see, I would go with that. <laughs> I'm a big Office fan. And believe it or not, my kids. Bears, Beats, and Battlestar Galactica. <laughs> <laughs> Fact. <laughs> <laughs> that was a ball. Starting to wonder if these girls' hands are sweaty. They're they're yeah. wiping them off. Yeah. Maybe it's for good luck. A little bit of both. <laughs> well, Scott could be the uh, regional manager. You to the be, regional manager. You could be the assistant to the regional. Oh, manager. ouch. And then, well, I know, but then Scott <laughs> could be. You could t tell talk him into being the assistant to the assistant to the regional manager. Yeah. He would report directly to himself. I definitely, as much as, ooh, there we go. So there's one. So I th we're at uh, 16 to 5 now? Oh, yeah. Thank you. I definitely think I'm the coolest one, so I would just have to be Jim. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, but if we were going off of parks and recreation uh, characters, I would definitely be more of a uh, Tom Haberford mixed with a D Andy Dwyer, <laughs> which is just a horrible mess in the making. I'll just be Ron. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. I'd be Creed. <laughs> Show up, play the off or play Whoa. solid. Oh. Hey, I'm a neutral party in this. I, I'm rooting for everybody. Yeah. There we go. Twelve made it. One made it. Oh man. Four made it. And ten. That just puts us at twenty to five now. You know, in a split second, something like that happens. Uh huh. Str I guess it's a strike. Yeah. That was some serious hustle around those bases. Holy cow. Yeah. My asthma is acting up, and I'm just sitting here. No. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, another nice hit out there in the left is. field there. That's zero that hit that. She is booking it. Look at her. Mm -hmm. Whoosh. Go, go, go. You gotta throw that ball. You can throw there it faster you. than you can run it. <laughs> Unless you're me. No. <laughs> All right, then you can't run it either. <laughs> I knew there was a reason why I never played softball. At this point in the game, I'd be like, yeah, you know what? That's kind of way out there. Well, I'm just a little tired right now. <laughs> no. Are they not having her on three? She just got off third base. Hmm. Must be, maybe, I, I don't know. Voluntary? <laughs> huh, I don't know. I mean. There's been some weird things happen here, I don't know.
There's another one. That was six. She got the first base. Yeah, I can't explain why Zero got off a third. Yeah, I don't know either. Hopefully the viewers know. <laughs> mm -hmm. But now we got second and first uh, players on second mm -hmm. and first. Ooh, 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 get that. Oh, no, no, hold the ball. Oh, no. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, no. So now those players that were on second and first <laughs> made it to third and second. <laughs> the dust in the air is just, it's given, uh, it's just given off that essence of this is the game. Mm-hmm. We're playing it. And the sun's going down. Now, do you like to draw or? Do I like to draw? Are you asking me that because you asked me about my, my tattoo earlier yeah. that I drew myself? I think he's really talented. Uh, I'm very bad at drawing. A lot of this was tracing and then filling in the blanks. Hmm. Well, it looks good. Thank you. Yeah, I'm probably the uh, most rebellious of the RTC crew. Blue hair, tattoos. Scott's taken a uh, big leap of faith with me. No. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he, he met me when I had blue hair back in high school, so... I just remember being 12 years old and riding my bike past RTC. I'm going to work there someday. Oh, that's cool. Uh, <laughs> yeah, again, I'm not real sure what happened with number zero there, but... Looks like the game finished up on the other field. All the car convoys oh, yeah, heading yeah. out. Still going strong here. A lot of people bring their dogs out here. I see that one over here. Yeah, there's one right Out back there, there towards... Oh, yeah, I see. Yeah, it's cute. Uh-huh. I like that about small towns. I, I lived in a big city for the past two years. And, you know, people would have their dogs and everything. But a lot of them would be service animals, which is, which is good and respectable. But, you know, <coughs> you can't just take it with you. <laughs> right. Yeah, unless it is a service animal. <coughs> Did you have your dogs in the city? Well, we lived in the suburbs. Um, but, yeah, we had four dogs at, at my parents' house where I was living with them. And then I took two of them with me. The other two stayed with them because they're kind of their dogs. Ah, gotcha. But, I don't know, something about little towns. You're able to just kind of bring your dog places that you normally wouldn't be. Right. I, I did. I did see this new fad um, of older women bringing very small dogs into Walmart when I was in the big city. <laughs> I'll be darn. <laughs> it's strange. I would have just like be walking around the dog food section or something, <laughs> and just a little dog would pop out of nowhere. Huh? And I'm like, what? That's I, funny. I know I couldn't do that with my big dogs. <laughs> Ooh. Swing and a miss. Number six is up to bat. 
She almost had it though. Uh -huh. I mean, it was right there. Every time they, every time they swing, they are so close. Ball. I have a black lab. Aw, I feel like it's a very Indiana dog. <laughs> I agree. Black labs here. I love black labs though. They stink when they get wet though. Yeah, mm. and stinky dogs. She likes to take a bath, but as soon as she's done, she wants to go outside and roll in the dirt every <laughs> time. That's being a dog. Yep. It's like, oh, you got me all clean and there not smelly. I need to take care of things here. Six is moving to first base, and we got number five up who's left-handed. I wonder if that, that um, makes it any harder for the pitcher when they're left-handed. It, it probably does, probably because they get used to... Favoring the right-handed. Mm -hmm. uh, even though they're supposed to be throwing straight. Right. The majority of it, but... <laughs> and a strike. <laughs> My lab's 10 years old. She's slowing oh. down. She have a little white face going on. Yeah, it's coming oh. right around here. <laughs> My heart. Yep. Um, I have an eight-year-old dozer. He's he's my pit bull. And a two-year-old Caesar. He's a Sharpe mix. I got him for Christmas. Oh. Yep. Everybody got I, I got everybody something for Christmas. That none of them got me anything. I said, "What do you want? <laughs> I just want a dog." <laughs> I didn't know his name. He just had a number on the website. Oh. And I went to the Humane Society and was down, this down there, down south, yeah. And uh, they told me his name was Caesar, spelled with a Z. So I was like, Caesar and Dozer, it matches. That's cool. It was meant to be. Totally. There we go. Oh. Oh wow. Oh. That was a good play. We did get Yeah, one. we got number six. She came in from third. 21 to six right now. Yeah, number 12 up to bat. No runners on. See, she has a gold helmet. I like that, too. Uh -huh. That's cool. Anything different. <laughs> Ooh, nice Ooh. hit. That was a solid hit. Oh, right through the second or shortstop and oh, keep, keep through going. the legs keep of going. the. Uh, there you nice. go. Nice. Got a double out of that. Awesome. She was hustling. Definitely. And we saw her up to bat a couple of times. And, mm -hmm. you know, every time she had her head down, and I knew she'd get it. You just gotta, you gotta keep believing in yourself. Yeah. That's a lot of the game. Is all mental state. Oh, whew. Thought she's gonna hit somebody. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gotta stop that. Hey, if something's coming towards me, I'm I'm swinging. <laughs> Horrifying. Hope. Oh. Oh. Strike three. Uh, I'm gonna tell you this now. I'm gonna have a heck of a farmer's tan <laughs> and a trucker's tan at the same time, <laughs> just on my right side from the sun. <sighs> There we go. Awesome. Oh, oh, way oh, overthrown. Oh, oh. Keep going. Keep it going. Go. There we go. We got 12 coming in on home. Nice. And we got nine all the way to second. We got a double out of that. There's that 21 and that seven. Told you. I love yeah. them. Yeah. I love those. If we just 
do the seven three more times and tie this baby up. <laughs> You know, I bet if we had the opportunity, they'd get it there. Ooh, another hit. Good. Runner at second held. Runners at first and second. Let's see here. We've got number four up to bat. I'll tell, you, I'll tell you what, I, I was mortified to come on here and just talk. Oh, yeah? Had no idea what I was going to say. I was like, mm, I don't know much about softball. <laughs> yeah. I knew they uh, threw under. That's about it. Right. <laughs> there we go. Four is on first. Come on, come oh, on, oh, come oh, on. Come oh. On. Nice. Awesome. That's number nine coming in. 21-8. It's good to see them stay in it, even though they know they were down. They didn't let themselves get down and out. Yeah, that, I mean, that's what Rochester is known for, honestly. All of these years that I've been filming sports, every single team, they just do that. Mm -hmm. They just they get that oomph when they when they know they need it. Right. It's like every single sportsman just like they feel it. <laughs> they just all feel it at once, and then they work as a team and they get where they need to be. Oof. So now we got a player on third and a player on second. Get another wild pitch like that, and we may have another run in. There we go, 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 go. Awesome. That was number eight coming in, making it 21 to 9. I know you're you're being the the good person here. You're rooting for both teams equally. I'm I'm like You're biased. Yeah, I am biased, aren't I? You're biased towards <laughs> who are you biased but, for? Oh, Rochester. I'm a Rochester guy. Hey, you know, there's no place. I should I be felt impartial. Like. I should be, but Are you from from Culver or anywhere else? No, nope, no. Nope, from nope. Rochester? Yeah. Born well, and raised? Well, I was born in Finley, Ohio. Ooh. But I was basically raised here. So. You're still a Midwest baby. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's what counts. <laughs> yeah, I've lived... Psh, I've lived in most of northern Indiana, so... Oh, cool. My, my dad lives in Culver, so... Okay. I support I support everybody. Yeah. Little, little bits and pieces everywhere. Your dad still live in Culver? Yeah, he's lived there since I was... Since before I was born. Since before my sister. No, not before my sister. I want to say he's lived there at least 28 years. Oh, wow. Oh, so, yeah. Big farmhouse. Cool. How many siblings do you have? I got an older sister and three older brothers. I'm oh, the baby. Wow. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. No. Oh, nope, she's safe. Oh, she's she dropped safe. the ball. That is insane. Awesome. Four. Six. Well, dispute on that one, but. Oh. Nope. And three made it all the way over to second base, so. All right, this has turned into a game. Oh, there's where our fence comes into play, mm -hmm. not hitting us. 
<laughs> like it. Yeah, I'm the baby of the group. Uh, my sister is 12 years older than me, and they all go two years apart, and I'm uh, five years apart. Oh, wow. I'm the last one. I was kind of like the oopsie. There we go. Nice. I got one on third, one on first. Well, I was a baby in my family, too. How many siblings did you have? I have a sister and three brothers. That, that's what I have. Yeah, you just said the two, yeah. <laughs> nice. Once I said it, I'm like, wait a minute. Yeah, she did just say that. Oh, my goodness. came in just now. <laughs> yeah, that's going to be it because of the amount of runs that they're allowed to have. So, that was still a great game, though. Yes. I enjoy well. myself. All right, final score, 21-11, Culver. It was a fun game. Both teams played good and hard. All right, well, you've been uh, watching live coverage here of the Junior Leagues, Rochester versus Culver. And I'm Jeremy here with Libby. And we want to thank you for tuning in. Thank you.